Hello and welcome to this week's Tech Tip. Today we're going to talk to about Animoto. Animoto is a way for students to share presentations with you. And so because we have used it here at Miller in the past, I have decided to revitalize it based on an email I received from Animoto today that talks about their new holiday backgrounds and themes. So I'm going to use one of those holiday themes since it is December and it is almost time to um, say happy holidays to everyone. So what I, ha what I have here is a bunch of pictures from our Miller staff as well as other little things. And to add pictures to your presentation or for your students to add them, it's very simple. Just click on the box. They can either add a picture here or they can add text. So let's add a picture. I'm on a computer, so I will upload pictures, but students can use photos from that they have in their system or they can get them from other places like Instagram if they have an Instagram account. Um, or same thing with the videos or if they're on a computer they can upload it so I have just uploaded a couple here so I'm going to add those in um, and here's another picture I'll add this one as well so that we have this um, and then let's add some text and I'm going to just say happy holidays that's for something quick and easy so that you can see how this looks once you have all of this done I did change the song uh, to Elle's Toy Workshop, which is part of their library. And now let's preview it. And you can use this with, you know, class pictures, or you can just use it. Um, you don't necessarily need to use a holiday background for when you're working with your students. Um, but I thought this would be a, a neat way to show you how to use this. So I have just some random pictures here. Another thing that you can also do um, as you go through, you can add a little caption here. So you can correct, uh, you can crop it, correct it, touch it up. So let's um, just add a little caption. Let's say I say this is um, a sweet teacher. Okay, and then it comes up and then let's preview what that looks like. Let's say this is um, the smart teacher. And then let's preview it. Let's see how this looks with the caption. So you can see how when students are presenting, you can they can show you a picture as well as a caption. They can create a title slide um, and it's a little bit something more interesting and there's my caption. Something a little bit more interesting than your traditional PowerPoint and of course then when you are finished and you decide that you will need to publish it, now, it will always say they have the little Animoto um, flag on there, but once you are ready to publish it, yes, they're telling me they want me to subscribe, um, then you will go over to Produce, and then you can title it here, so I'm just going to call it the holiday video, and you can have a date on it. Today is the 5th. On the, which is the date I'm recording it. And then I hit finish. And when you finish it, then you can share this with other, um, with everyone. You can put have the kids put it on YouTube and this way they can go ahead and share that link with you. And then you can watch it or you can show it in front of the class. Um, students do not have to be afraid to use, use YouTube. They can share it as, um, private where they would only see it so then they would have to pull it up or they can share it as unlisted so that you need a link to find it. So that is just a quick and easy way to use Animoto. 
I hope you enjoyed this video. Please let me know what you think. And uh, thank you for tuning in to this week's Tech Tip.